What's up guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna unbox one of my most favorite form of Goku in Dragon Ball Z and that is Super Saiyan 3 Goku made by Figure Class um, Remember I told you guys I don't collect 1 6 or smaller scale of statues before of Dragon Ball Z but this is an exception because the statue is very awesome looking I think it's one of the most correct stay true to the character of Super Saiyan 3 Goku in the anime as well as the manga and now I'm gonna show you guys the box so you guys can see it alright there we go as always figure class makes awesome looking art boxes as you can see right here in the front we have Super Saiyan 3 Goku looking serious as ever and down here you can see the uh, name of the statue slash uh, the title Dragon Ball Ultimate Collection um, Super Saiyan 3, I think, down below here. And um, right behind the uh, color Goku is like a black and white, bigger version of the statue. And on the side is some more back shot of Goku. And behind, you can see the face right here and all the information down here. And on this side, you guys can kind of see how the statue looks like. So, yeah. Awesome art box. I have number 469 out of 666 pieces um, writing at the top. And now I'm gonna get to the unboxing and I'll see you guys afterwards so I can talk more about this statue. Peace out everybody. back and that was an unboxing of Super Saiyan 3 Goku made by Figure Class from Dragon Ball Z. As you guys can see the way that they designed this statue, the engineer behind it is so cool. Um, you have this beautiful chrome slash yellow uh, black on the base and on top of that is this amazing wavy looking water because this battle takes place in the middle of the ocean. So you have this you know detail looking water. And above that is this combination of yellow aura surrounding Goku. You have this big pieces of aura, um, heavy around him, and then this small thin pieces combining that with the electricity. And also they included with this awesome light up feature, which I'm gonna plug it in right now so you guys can see it. There we go. Now I'm gonna give you guys some close up look on this statue. All right guys, first thing first, here is the certificate of authenticity. As you can see, I have number 469 right here and a picture of Super Saiyan 3 Goku you know, with this very colorful rainbow looking card. Um, I can take this out but I prefer to leave it in plastic like this. Behind that you guys can see the 7 Dragon Balls and the company figure class. 
and I really like the way that they made this underbase right here. You know, you have chrome, gold looking, stripe, top and bottom running all around the base. And on the side is the collections, words on it, and in front, and on the side it says Dragon Ball. You know, no usual Dragon Ball Z logo in the front but rather than just Goku's logo and on the side is Dragon Ball and collection and then take a look at this beautiful looking water effect wavy and to top it off with a awesome light up feature as you can see different shading areas like you have dark blue right here and you have this white tip to emphasize the light up and then you have this little slashes detail all around this water. And now we get to the electricity. Since this is a Super CN3, you can see the thickness of the electricity. It's not like normal Super Saiyan where you have just like small thin pieces, but this is actually very thick and big to show how intense Super Saiyan 3 is. And then we get to the main character, Goku. The face looks just like in the anime where he was glaring at Majin Buu. This is after he achieved this superpower for the first time. He went beyond Super Saiyan 2 with this beautiful long hair with different shading areas and the no eyebrow face making him look very serious <laughs> his clothes doesn't have any textures but it does have some awesome shading as you can see the boots down below and then as it goes to the pants different color of shading you know looks natural and then the shirt as well So now I'm going to turn off some light so you can see how this statue lit up in the dark. By the way, since he's dead, I forgot to put a little crown on him. <laughs> this halo. Just leave it on like this. Now we have a Halo Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Alright, there we go. Beautiful light up feature as you can see. Really emphasize the water effect as well as the big auras at the top. And I'm gonna turn off the background light so you can see it even better. Wow, very cool and bright lighter feature. I've turned off all my lights already. So this is how it looked completely in the dark. Now you guys can understand why that I say I don't collect 1.6 to 1.7 small scale statues anymore because I have several of them already. But this statue is an exception because how beautiful it is. You have this black on the base with chrome running around the whole base right here and then up top is this wavy looking water so many textures and details on it and above that is this big yellow aura uh, with smaller parts of electricity as well as the smaller aura all surrounding Goku and to top it off with an awesome looking lighter feature like this Super Saiyan 3 is one of my most favorite form of Goku and I'm so glad to be able to add this statue to my collection because how awesome looking he is. It's like a must have if you are a Super Saiyan 3 fan. The long hair, the serious face, the details on the clothing, the shading. Although Goku standing in a simple pose, but what's amazing is that they add these. They know how to add these, you know, effect, the water, the uh, big auras, the small auras, and the electricity. All of that combined making this statue looks very cool and dynamic. So yeah, thank you everybody for watching me unboxing this awesome looking Super Saiyan 3 Goku made by Figure Class from Dragon Ball Z. If you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up, you know. It really helped me pump out more content for you guys. And subscribe for more unboxing, more review. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out everybody. Goodbye.